Hey y'all and welcome back to the party. It's me, your girl, Britt Reacts, and today we are reacting to BTS Mic Drop. Let's see what they have to say. There's my computer acting crazy again. Can we not? <laughs> okay, let me turn my captions on. Are y'all ready? Let's do it. Ooh, okay, press conference in what looks like a prison. <laughs> okay, this is, okay, there's a. I love the way they're setting this up. It's gonna be a good time for sure. Uh, Steve, I think it's Aiki, Aoki. I don't know how to say his last name. I know that he's like a mega DJ though. Like he's one of those DJs that like, one set is like a million like he is like a mega superstar and the fact that he's in this video and like it's the official remix is kind of dope super dope actually Ooh. B is crazy. It's crazy. Yeah, you got a suja daughter pay. I don't pay. Bite job of gum suja yada pay. But okay, Jamo digging got the stacky yada gay. Go to first, she was you can stop. Hey, go to gay. Right, best man. Action. Sober else me. We are in prison. <laughs> there was a riot, which is maybe why they're in prison. This is giving like bad boy energy. The the production is wild. Like this is why this man is such a great in the DJ world. Cause I mean this production is top tier the rapping is like I, I did not I don't know what I expected but it wasn't a rap track it's crazy he said in a concert we have no empty seats don't even think about it Choreography is just, I need, I need some water. Hold on, y'all. Everything's moving so fast. I just, oh my gosh. I'm having a BTS meltdown right now. I like in this one how they're like kind of breaking the group down into like smaller groups. Like there's five of them. There were five of them in another one of the dance scenes. Um, I don't know. I just think that's like an interesting choice to not use all seven of them in each scene. I think that's cool. These are 
are very like trendy dance moves that they're doing like whoever does their choreography is just like so infiltrated into the dance industry because their choreography is always very relevant it's very fresh it never feels dated or old like they are doing I don't know when this was filmed it does seem like they some of the guys look a little younger in the face you know people just they're they mature I could be totally wrong but some of them feel a little younger to me um but th this is even the music the um the ad libs and stuff are def definitely like relevant to a certain time in hip hop and 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 the cultural movement of music and they're like right on top of it it's interesting <laughs> Like this, you know what I mean? That's like a TikTok dance. Like they're just so good at being relevant and being on trend at all times. It's crazy. It's so Y'all thought I wasn't going to say anything about the off-white that they're wearing in this video. It's just the fashion. Always. So off-white is like one of my favorite brands. And they look good in it. Haters gonna hate. Players gonna play. If you know... I'm not going to say the original because that, that's a phrase that has been in the culture forever. But haters, they're going to hate. And ballers, they're going to ball. Callers, they're going to call. Shot caller. I think they ain't got nothing to do. If you know that song where the, where the phrase kind of like blew up, drop it in the comments because we're meant to be friends. Haters, they're going to hate. And ballers, they're going to ball. Such a good song. Throwback, though. So if you know, we should be friends. The song is appropriately named, and that's what I'm going to leave you with. The name of the song is so appropriate, and I love that he dropped the mic at the end. 10 out of 10. Go have the day you deserve. Peace.